in northeast Brazil in the blue. The number seven seeds, Andressa and Tanya on home sand. Up against the team they know very well indeed, Agatha and Rebecca. It'll be interesting to see, particularly where Andressa and Tanya want to go. And we were surprised to see the number two seeds going after Tanya initially, who's got to Argentina. But uh, straight sets lost to a team who look in great form at Luna van der Velde coming through the qualifiers. Agatha will surely target her again straight away. No, no, she can't. She can't play. But we've seen stranger things on a beach volleyball court. Standing float. Tanya is going all the way into the net. They're not split blocking. It seemed a little unbalanced. Good touch from Rebecca. That's a nice pull from Tanya, but you can see those minor adjustments that you require full composure and full movement to make. Short serve. Picked up, free ball. Rebecca looks, well, the line was wide open and she's hit to both players there. Well, Tanya is uh, up for the fight. She's still scurrying around, albeit. I think this is how we're going to see out the match with this kind of thing going on. Number two seeds in yellow will just keep forging the lead, siding out pretty easily. I can't see Tanya wanting to stay out there. Again, serving with the option for Andressa to play it. Tanya can't get into position to bump that with control, favouring her right leg. Tanya's definitely warmed up. Tanya and Andressa can just go for their serves. She's done. Picked up by Agatha Just, but a chance for a point here in transition. Just can't get some heat on the ball, can she? And just can't get the kind of height she wants out of the sand. And whenever she lands, she's landing almost one-legged now. Here's Tanya. Short this time, it's worked. Nicely done. Lovely shot. It will settle. The warmer she gets, the more she plays. Maybe it will just allow her to get into the match. It's a big maybe though. They go to Andressa. He makes that look really easy. Tanya clearly in a bit of pain here. Agatha and Rebecca handling the situation well. Back to Tanya. Good pass. Good set, but not enough on that. It's all pretty much by the numbers at the moment for Tanya. She's not really able to pull away from the net with any. Just looking to get this over the line, the team in yellow. And they do. So there we go. I, I don't expect to see much different in set two. At the moment, it's Agatha and Rebecca heading to their second victory in pool B. Away we go with second set. The uh, number two seeds in yellow, Agatha and Rebecca lead. In the centre court here in Joao Passau. Hindered and hampered by injury to Tanya, her left foot. That's the problem. 
pretty well jumping against Rebecca there. And an extended rally finishes in a point to the team in blue. There or thereabouts on the scoreboard, maybe, maybe they can just force the issue. Well, that's not going to help, is it? She doesn't have to do a huge amount to make that ball work for her. A bit like that serve to Agatha. Blues 5-3. Better serve. That's a huge, huge reach. Well, they fancy their chances against Andressa here. And they're making it count. A couple of quick points to take the lead. Serve between the two players. Andressa passed it in the end. And hooves it up quite nicely in the back court, but Agatha now should swing for the point and does so pretty easily. Up you get. Come on. Play on. There is a weird malaise that has dropped over centre court. Oh. The conditions beautiful again for the third day in a row. Well played. Net touch. I honestly thought we'd see her playing a bit of defence in this partnership, but with the injured foot, clearly feels that it's not. And again, goes after Andressa who is finding some rhythm here. I think they've got to reconsider. Gets the ball into play this time and once more stroke down the line, this time by Agatha. They've served Andressa almost exclusively in set two. They've gone after her again and it's an ace. That's a very nice serve. Over, over trying to get Tanya to cover more court. Straight out Andressa this time, who pokies for fun. Has a real beach feel. Good hustle. Well, it would have been down the middle. The net's taking it off to the side. And Tanya's passed it beautifully. And that's a very good arm swing. You've got to be very careful about the length of your arm swing. And she's got good contact on that ball. Lovely timing. But relatively short swing. Andressa pounds it. Medical timeout in set one for Tanya. I'm amazed she carried on, but she has. And now starting to make some points. Good hit inside to out from Agatha to work with. And she's doing the job very well indeed for an injured player. Little dropper. And he deals with it well. And just poking through from Agatha. Good contest at the net. Rebecca's in the right place again in the pocket for the Andressa hit and then pings it with her outstretched arms. For Andressa moving. Very easily, can't get past the block of Agatha. And then the pull is okay. Completely brand new. Mikasa Beach Pro Tour ball now. It's been in uh, action for a season and a bit. Just doing enough. A couple more side outs and that'll be it. Swing, nice pocket dig. Dresser initially stayed into block. That's a very precise. And Andressa has done well to support her, but it's uh, in the end, it was never going to be enough. Out it goes. Game over. 21-16 in the second set. Agatha and Rebecca beat a depleted. Tanya and Andressa team and that's nice to see both players uh, wishing Tanya all the best.